Yo, what's good, YouTube? I look like a remedial troglodyte right now. <laughs> it's my nigga Bo Heen, man. What's happening? What's happening? What's happening? Feel me? We finna get my boy right, you know? Gotta do something. We over here at Genuine Cuts, you know, live from Wisco. Yes, sir. You know? What up? I'm gonna get you right, man. What up, Smoker Fat J? What's good? What up, Anonymous? Are they on there? Are yeah, they, they popping they in? What up, Cream? Tagging what in. What up, Drip? We got uh, 20 people now. Let's get it. Everybody drop a like, man, if you want me to transform oh, yeah. from, from homeless to passable. <laughs> What's good, Tammy? I'm going to let y'all see me transform. We got 40 people in here now. Seven likes. Come on, y'all. Oh, yeah. If y'all got notifications on, y'all better drop them likes. Hell yeah. Or else I ain't even going to say what I was going to say next because I started cleaning it up. You know, YouTube made me a clean person. And I got dirty thoughts. I mean, <laughs> hey, what up, Bob G? What up, gang bang? It's my nigga Boheme, man. Man, we up in here, man. You already know it, man. The best barber ever, so. Best barber ever. What up, Lee? 52 people. Let's go. We climbing. What's up with them likes, nigga? Don't make me upstrap on y'all and get them likes popping. <laughs> All right, we getting it. I can't control Nightbot now. If y'all say crazy shit, Nightbot might get at y'all. Where them new glitches at? I'll drop a new GTA video sometime. But don't y'all want me to look less homeless first? Shout out my nigga Bo. Hey, when he, he about to make his YouTube channel soon. Oh, yeah, like yeah. a live in the barbershop conversation type channel. Oh, you feel yeah. me? Oh, yeah. It's a little preview right here. That's you know? it. Shout out to my boy Joey for getting us right, man. You dig? Yeah, no. 56 people, thank y'all so much for being in here. Let's get it. We hanging out. <laughs> what y'all want to talk about? He said MGG going from rags to riches. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, I am on rags. Look how <laughs> nappy my beard is. It's like coagulated taco meat. Oh, no. Nah. We can get that cleaned he up. He said, real Who is quick. this homeless guy? <laughs> we can get that cleaned up real quick. What they be up to? So, what, what's your core base followers? What would everybody be on that uh, follow you? Just video game shit. Yeah. Okay, they want to know Popeyes or Chick fil A. I knew they was going to come with it. Oh, yeah. Hey, Listen, I if y'all look at, y'all should look at two months ago, I was tweeting and Facebooking about that chicken sandwich at Popeyes. See, I'm a professional fat person. All these other people is bandwagon. They bandwagon fat people. I'm definitely they a bandwagon just trying it right now. Man, I was look at my social media, y'all. Two months ago, I said that chick uh, Popeye's chicken sandwich is gonna be the next president of the United States. Damn. <laughs> what up, Ali? You know, I want to try it on Sunday. How you doing, G? Time. We waiting in line. Oh, yeah. And sure enough, man, I think I ate both of them damn sandwiches before I made it home. I, I swear to God, man. And listen, I just drove by Popeye's right now, y'all. It's 1230 in the afternoon. The line is outside the building. On a Monday. The On a Monday at noon. <laughs> hey, you said it's the wacky inflatable balloon, man. <laughs> y'all love that shit. That's my nickname. Yeah. They, they made it stick, man. <laughs> they made it stick, man. I was just clowning one day. Cut my head bald. bald Cut bald. you a bald head, motherfucker. <laughs> we can't go that long. Hey, we ain't going bald, though. Look at them getting me right, right in front of y'all, though. Yeah, we'll take it with. You know what I'm saying? Oh, yeah. What's good, Jerry? How you doing, man? Welcome to the stream, bro. We in here kicking it. Anybody want to have some barber barbershop talk with me and Boheme, man? Yeah. Come on and bring up some. He said, Mr. Queen, because my shit's shining. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, he what up, Jake? This was on the spot, by the way, too. Oh, yeah, random. They already know how I get down. We got about 50 people that are tuning in and watch me get faded up, though. Anyway. Yeah, that's true. I do got a receding hairline on one side for like an inch and a half. Man, we ain't worried about that. It don't that. make no sense. I'm, I told them to imagine, do an imaginary lining. I got a... I got a uh, you know, I got the magical skills, man. Oh, he said, Juice Manning said, hey, give me the Mr. T. The Mr. <laughs> Wait a minute, bro. What's that? Uh, Rick Who was that? that be saying that. Wait a minute, bro. <laughs> that Rick Flair. You want to give me the Mr. T? All right. Hey, what kind of haircut should I get, y'all? I'll let y'all input. What I need to do with my beard? Should I just keep it popping for no shave November? 
<laughs> Just kidding. I want to get rid of this shit. Jerry Cohen said, Woo, it's Ric Flair. It's Ric Flair. <laughs> King Alexander, what's popping? Kind of hot in here. I think I'm sweating. My bad, bro. Are you? A little bit. You don't see me? I ain't like sweating, 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 but I'm sweating, sweating. Hey, you know, we got the AC right here. Hop in. Right and look, he got his phone thing up there, y'all. Yeah, yeah. That's where he's going to go live from, yeah, bro. Put on my, yeah. So we go, he going to go live from over there, man. This going to be the best barbershop show since LeBron James. <laughs> ain't them little mini brown brown. Ain't it, man. I'll be out there busting his ass on the basketball court, y'all. <laughs> Hey, I'm cold though, man. I'm cold. I'm lazy, but I'm cold. Like I got a nice little hezzy. Man, step you ain't been back. on the court in how long? I ain't been on the court since Obama was president. <laughs> <laughs> hey, but I'm still nice. It's like riding a bike, man. When you got a step back jump shot, that shit's smooth forever. You better put some oil in that chain, cause your shit's slipping. <laughs> that chain's slipping. Shit, nigga. Tighten up. I got a new transmission, <laughs> man. We be back on the road. <laughs> I is slipping, tighten up. Yo, he getting me fucking right, y'all. AC working for you? Yeah, thank you. Appreciate you, brother. Man, more than welcome, my dude. Man, even if he left it like this, I would look a million times better <laughs> from when I started streaming. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you're going to have to come visit, man, bring your family back with you another time, too, man. I, li I like that. Yes, sir. We got 62 people live. Thank y'all so much for being here, man. Ain't no video games going on. They, t they asking me about Popeye's chicken. Or Chick Fil A, or Wendy's. I seen Wendy's get in that conversation. Let me tell y'all what the best breaded chicken sandwich is. The the jailhouse. It ain't even real chicken. It's uh, what do they call that shit? Soybean, nigga. <laughs> I'm on your way. No, I need that. I just almost dropped it. <laughs> they got the soybean chicken sandwich, and when you go to jail, nigga, that shit good. I trade that shit for two Kool Aids. <laughs> He said, get the Brick Ross beer lineup. Chick-fil-A all day. Yeah, Chick-fil-A is a nice Christian chicken sandwich. Man, to the Louisiana chicken sandwich. Yeah, that's right, though, man. That that Popeye's chicken sandwich, man, I will, I will skip some coochie to go eat that sandwich in the, in the Walmart parking lot and then cry, and then cry myself to sleep <laughs> and have a great evening. You be hungry. Oh, you, be, oh, you won't be hungry. Eat the Popeyes, man. I was listen, man. Y'all talking about that right now? That's a joke, man. I'm a professional fat person. I was I was tweeting and telling everybody how miraculous it was like a month ago. So what's gonna be the next situation? The next thing that's gonna be KFC fell all the way off. KFC, all they supposed to do is chicken, and they can't even do that. Yo, what's up, nigga? How you doing? You like all them products I added, and you see all them links be working now. Yeah, I just got a few more categories to fill in. What's good, though? Mm -hmm. Want to tape it or not? Yes, sir. Please. Mm -hmm. No, I haven't done. I haven't done any. Um, What's going on? Like, right there? we still got. You know what I'm saying? People salute. I just building the categories now. Yeah, looking fresh though. We appreciate that. Yeah. Appreciate that. Salute y'all, man. Yeah, of course. Yeah, sure. But not like I haven't like edited it on mobile or whatever. You know, we getting it in, man. That's what I do. Yeah. I'm doing this one thing at a time. Boy. You gonna make Frankenbike go alive? He said he next. Jerry said he next. He need a cut. Hey, you come through, man. I'll take care of you. So you gonna turn that Frankenbike and make it come alive? It ain't a problem, my buddy. 
Nice. When I used to do their social media marketing, I've worked on that website. I built that website and shit. Crazy Lenny's, that's on Shopify. I built that website. <laughs> yep. That shit sucks. It's a programming language called Liquid. It fucking sucks. I'll never do a pro I'll never do a Shopify again, ever again, because of him. <laughs> but yeah, all right, I'll hit you up. I'm just getting a haircut right now. Then I'm gonna get back on it. Hit him with this little sticker right here. Oh, you see the business card on there too. Yeah. You know how we I'll hit you up when I leave. Use the business card for the product. All right, so yeah. We gonna hit him with this little, this little extra little love. It's that little black magic right here. Like he put me with the Steve Harvey shit. Just a little more legit. Just soft with it. What up, Car Carlton Colson? He said, what the fuck is this? Why you click on it, bitch? You seen the title? You seen the fucking thumbnail, nigga? Don't make me fucking... Don't make me come over there, man. Stop playing with my boy, man. He said, what the fuck is this shit, man? You know what the fuck is this shit. Do not act stupid, motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> You know what the fuck is this shit, motherfucker? What up, Robert E. Work? <laughs> what up, Drip Wolves? What is this about? I don't know. Your mom told me that I gotta come correct if I'm gonna take her bowling later, so <laughs> I'm getting my hair cut. I'm finna put on a, a button up, and I'm finna respect her as the woman she deserves to be. Jess Lama, you got a YouTube channel? Get them nose hairs. Ain't no nose hairs, nigga. I ain't that old. Shit, them motherfuckers grow over the years. <laughs> what up, Carter? Yo, what up, OG Dre? What's good, man? A lot of good little niggas kick, kicking it with your boy and GG in this bitch. <laughs> okay. I'm going from busted to trusted. <laughs> I'm going from joke to broke. <laughs> to provoke. Ricky G was popping. What up, L Amazed? You know what I realized, man? What's good? They say it's supposed to be a recession next year or something like that, right? Did you hear about that? Because of China wars? I'm not sure if it's that up. Yeah, it's the trade wars and the tariffs with China. I understand it, though. Right, right. I understand it. Do y'all... I don't want to talk about nothing corny, but do y'all know what's going on with the trade wars with China? Even if y'all don't want to know what's going on, it's going to affect you either way. That's what I was thinking. I know what's going on. That's the real deal. Truth said, can he get a cut? He wild, He white and he got wild hair, though. Man, what up, True? What you need? Bro? Come through, True. Come to Madison, pay. Wisconsin, man. Right downtown by the Capitol, bro. Yeah, boy, what you need, man? You ain't saying nothing but Share a word, the knowledge, bro. everybody said. Okay, let's. y'all know I'm a smart nigga, man. Yeah. I'll tell y'all what's going on with the trade war so y'all can understand it and why Donald Trump actually is going at China like he is. Everybody thinks Donald Trump is stupid but he's not stupid. Everybody thinks that Donald Trump doesn't have America's best in his mind, but he do. Y'all just ignorant. Y'all not looking it up. I don't like Donald Trump by any means, but this is what I will say. He's an incredible businessman and he's doing everything he's doing to China for you. Mm. Let me explain. Every year. I got you, just one, there you go. Okay. Every year, only 4% of China's population, what they let in like only 4,000 people into their country every year, not because they don't want, they have tight borders or nothing like that. It's because nobody wants to live in China. Nobody migrates to China every year. But every year America lets in over 40,000 new citizens, which is the most in the world. Keep that in mind. Now let's talk about tariffs, import and export. Every year, America makes $3 trillion that China collects 
and they only put $1 trillion into our economy. So everyone wants to come here and be American, but we're getting the short end of the stick when it comes to how much money we're making off of the other country. I fuck with Donald Trump because of that. They need us more than we need them. You feel me? All right. That's just how it is. China needs us more than we need them. They collecting all this money off of us and they not putting it back into our country. And we got the control. Like, why would you be in any business situation and let somebody be getting over on you like that? That's just the bottom line. Donald Trump don't got to be a genius to see that we make it a trillion dollars for every three trillion dollars in the business with them. Everybody eating. Don't get me wrong. The economy is great under this. Everybody eating. But fuck that. Donald Trump said we need our bread, church. <laughs> <laughs> Donald Trump said we need that bread, church. And we're going to get it somehow. Somehow, somewhere. Somehow, we're going to get it. I can't be mad at him over that. This is what he's there for. This is what he's there for. That's what they do. I don't give a fuck about none of that shit. I ain't got nothing to do with that. I'm not at the, I'm not wearing no suit doing all that bullshit. So before y'all judge Donald Trump for what he's doing to China, they need us more than we need them. More people come in here than they go there. So what they going to do? China going to act tough for a little bit. It's going to hurt us a little bit. And at the end of the day, it's going to hurt them more than it hurt us. That's the bottom line. So Donald Trump know that no matter how much American people hurt like me, because I import Chinese goods. Nigga, I was eating off of that shit like 2016, 2017, 2018, nigga. No tariffs. Nigga, I was getting shit imported, bruh. Selling that shit straight up right away, flipping it for 200 when I only paid like $30 for it because that was the market that was created in America. China not respecting that market that we created in America. They undercutting it. And they trying to always get the big end of the stick. All Donald Trump was saying is, Nigga, we need to balance this out when we got where everybody want to be. Everybody want to be in America. Look at the numbers. So at the end of the day, we got the product. We got the consumers right. Chinese consumers don't buy shit. They not paying trillions of dollars for no plastic hunks of bullshit. So just remember, might be a little recession. Hey, what up, Sean? I'm good. Give me a second while you line me up, nigga. What y'all think about the trade wars and the tariffs? Nothing, because y'all don't give a fuck. Y'all just sitting there eating chicken sandwiches and shit and doing what the internet say? Cool. <laughs> King Alexander, we the best. You <laughs> <laughs> said you're getting your DJ Cali on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yo, if y'all see the beginning of the video and then right now, man, damn. I went from monkey to a hunky, but with a U instead of a O, not the racist white term. <laughs> You've been unconnected to the world for two years, but you subscribed to me. Thanks, motherfucker. <laughs> I've been always unconnected to the world because you got to be willing to learn their bullshit to get programmed by it. And I got, I was born with a no bullshit filter. So I don't see that shit the same. Man, I'm going to have a coochie on my face by the time I get off the elevator downstairs. <laughs> hey, man. Chinese, real Chinese food is disgusting. The shit we got in America is delicious because we fry it and dip it in bullshit. But y'all don't know the history of Chinese restaurants, but I tell you, back in the day when people talk about a lot when black people were slaves or whatever, first of all, not every black person was a slave. Not even like most of them. Slaves was just something like we got in society with Mexicans these days where you see people doing jobs that's kind of illegal and shit like that. It's been the same the whole time. Secondly, Chinese food, it used to be illegal for China, in, in, Asian immigrants to do anything besides run restaurants. That's why you see in every society, even in the most racist old school society, you see that the Asian people, whether they Lao, Thailand, Bangkok, they all have Chinese restaurants. 
in the early 1900s and shit, they wasn't allowed to do nothing else. I'm telling y'all, it's the world is fucked up. Y'all some probably young ass niggas in here. Yeah, this the real money glitch guy. Y'all niggas ain't never see, some of y'all niggas ain't never seen me. <laughs> I know most of y'all see me as a cartoon character most of the time, nigga. But yeah, that's the truth, man. Y'all better know what's up, man. Chinese people and Asian people didn't even used to be able to do no other business. That's why they passed down the Asian restaurants to their family. Now they actually getting bread off of it. But back in the day, they used to get arrested for doing other jobs and shit. Shit was fucked up. People don't know about the struggle Asians went through here. Feel me? We doing all right, Bohem. Oh yeah, we still rocking and roll. We is, bro. Oh yeah, and they sticking around. What's happening? A little bit, you know. Indian people too. Yeah. Tell me about the Indian people, man, because I need to learn more about that, Andrew. If that's what you get down like. Yeah, that's true, man. My dog trying to transform from Beauty and the Beast to Tyrese. Gay. <laughs> <laughs> Got that super ninja confidence now. You know how it is, man. You can use double GGA in here, man. You my nigga. You know what I'm saying? Don't front on me. I got to be able to tell the difference. Is you is or is you ain't my nigga? Indians could only sell furniture and spices? Really? That That's right. fucked up. I'm going to look into that, man. One of my good friends, the dude who called me on the phone was an Indian cat. You know what I'm saying? Watch this girl call. Trim. For a proper trim, where you at? Depending on how far you coming. That nigga in UK, man. He in English. Oh, yeah. You know, we... <laughs> <laughs> if you come from the UK, we we'll hook you up for, for free, free, nigga. I'll yeah. pay for that yeah, shit. Yeah, yeah. That's what I was going to say. <laughs> Depending on where you from. You down the street, I'm going to need my money. Mm-hmm. You coming up the road. Yeah, buddy. how we getting down, man. You got to groom the man that's behind the works. You know, with that, his YouTube channel. Mm. You got a whole family. What's y'all family? What's the family name? They said you better groom than my girl now, man. <laughs> <laughs> I might have to shut up, man, while you lining up my lips and shit. Sad. I can do this other side over there. Yeah, time. You know, if that AC gets too cold. Yeah. My cat doing well, man. He's a little bastard. Hey, you got a cat you put on that? One through ten, how good is he at cutting hair? You y'all tell me. Y'all tell me. And he got the pressure on him cause he live. I have no pressure. He got the pressure on him because he lied. Ain't no <laughs> that sounds like a metaphor. Mm -hmm. What do you call that? Needed a pressure. How my dragon doing? My dragon cool, man. I love that little nigga. He the most chill pet I ever had in my life. Yeah, ain't no pressure on this, baby. He said 9 out of 10 for the sharp edges. He ain't done yet, man. Shit is a 10. I got a choice to where I want to get my hair cut, nigga. So it's about, we got a whole setup down here, man. We right here in the, in the heart of the city. Two and a half stars out of two and a half stars. <laughs> hey, wherever you at, man, Norway or something, man, thank you. <laughs> Have I ever cheated on my barber before? Nigga, I don't never get my hair cut. I might go two years without getting the haircut. <laughs> I should have seen him from the beginning. He look like a whole new man already. Yes, sir. That's why I want to get rid of my beard, really. Because it'd be so long between, between haircuts. Yeah, I forgot we did it the last time. Because it has been so long. I know, because it just be covering itself up. Typically, you know. 
podcast come back, I can look at my old style of what I did and go right off of that. <laughs> <laughs> you come back, you a, a whole bitch. I come back as a monkey, not even speaking English. Like, come <laughs> <laughs> on, so give me the last cut you gave me. Shit, what was that? Last time, I think I went thin on the mustache, and then facial hair was more like dude down in the middle. In the middle at the bottom. Oh, yeah? No, in the middle. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Like, sideburns straight down, and oh, if any... Do that? Yeah. You want me to take it down some more? What's yes. Doing? Same as, like, dude. Let's get rid of it, and then thin mustache. Oh, okay. So, just sideburn. No, no, no. You gonna talk to the people, see what they want? Straight down, oh, okay. you know, like a straight line, and then just cut it off. Oh, You'll be okay. fine. Keep you. a goatee if you want, but thin. Okay. We yeah. go thin this time. Okay, well, now y'all seeing another transformation. He just got two cuts in one. Yeah, I'm going to hook him up, though, y'all. he been a good sport during this live session. Oh, yeah. I told Bohem he need to do this all the time, y'all. Seriously, on, he'll make on, some man. real money. I just got married, man. I had some other things in order, you know what I mean? He did just get married. He got the best tuxedo i ever seen so far. Oh, yeah. I ain't, I'm going to keep an open mind to the future tuxedos. But so far, yes. he got the best one i ever Shout seen. Out to my boys, Ellis. Ellis ESQ. That's quiet. Yeah, they did it for me, man. It was nice. I think they, they, they got a Canada or something like that, by the way of... South Carolina. Damn, my head looked like a melting candy bar in the mirror. <laughs> Look at a pile of taco meat in a baggie. In a baggie. Selling that, uh... Would y'all watch Boheme's uh, barbershop show? He has special guests in there every week, like LeBron or something. Next time it's going to be LeBron in the chair. Selfie video. Man, speak that into existence. That's what I'm doing. Yeah, speak that into existence. He said it looked like a melted willy. <laughs> what the fuck is a willy, man? Where you from, bro? <laughs> Check out them sideburns. That's how you want them. Yes, sir. Oh, yeah, by the way, we represent Mad Town. That's on the shirt. That's on the shirt. <laughs> Bunch of people going to tune in and see this when they get off work, too. Yeah. A lot of people at work and at school doing shit like that. Yeah, I'm gonna have to get my YouTube going. You're gonna have to come back. We're gonna have to do this again. So. I swear to God, man, yeah, this would be a this is a great episode. If nothing else, y'all, I'm just gonna always live stream when I come in here and talk to the boy. <laughs> we always have good thought provoking conversation. And he said he at work high watching this. <laughs> I'm asleep. <laughs> you said Milwaukee's better. I will beat your motherfucking ass, nigga. We gonna uh, have to fight to the death the there. You know a little something, Where brother. you from? What you mean, Milwaukee better? Where you from? He said I look like the guy from what? Don't make me scroll back up and read that, man. What'd you say I look like the dude from? <laughs> Where you from, my, my G? Sonny the Gamer said it's good to see another side of me. Yeah, this real life, bro. Y'all want me to start going live in real life? Said it feel like the barbershop movie. That's the whole point. I really think Bo could make a, a the dopest YouTube creative. Like, it would just just record what happened. Maybe not everything is for TV though. But uh, we on the way. I got some nice uh, political people, school people, hood people that like to come in. See what I mean? That would be such a good channel to and, just watch the difference and voice their opinions. And you get to see like the art, you know? Oh yeah. What they do on YouTube? Uh, not YouTube, but like. You seen the LeBron one? They be doing what they say the most satisfying uh, stuff. Oh, they love it. They yeah. say go live and do this stuff more often. Oh yeah. It's your boy MGG man. I'm with Bo Heat man. Yeah, we up. I taught him everything: man. how to play basketball, how to treat a lady, how to tie his shoe. This is anger. <laughs> <laughs> it's your station. I'm gonna let you have that. I'm gonna let you have that. Uh, gross. Typically say how much to cut his pubes. To cut his pubes? That's a female saying that? I hope so. <laughs> it doesn't What's the name of it? Tiffy? Tempest something. Tempest? Oh, nah, he tripping. Yeah, you tripping, bro. He tripping. Ain't nobody, you think somebody would do that, bro? If you, we would set the appointment up and beat your motherfucking ass when you got here, <laughs> nigga. Come on. Straight up. This, my nigga ain't waxing nobody balls, bro. 
Yeah, Straight up. Ain't bring, none of, ain't we ain't gotta do none of that. Bring your mama. Yeah, bring your mama to get her pussy waxed so though, nigga. Get, uh, what they call it. <laughs> Brazilian with the <laughs> Matthew Daly going in. He said, Well, they do pubes in Milwaukee, nigga, so I'm gonna go to Milwaukee. Oh, yeah, well, take your ass to Milwaukee. <laughs> it sound, that sound right, actually. That's why I don't live there. Take your ass to Milwaukee. They trimming up pubes in Milwaukee. That's why I don't live there. How bro. you sitting? <laughs> <laughs> they make you lean back like Hey, Joe. they put you in one of them things that they do women pap smears in. Mm hmm. Put his legs up. It's Camilla said, ooh, look at you. You sexy. I know I got 5% women in my audience. How you doing, Camilla? <laughs> he said his mama 81, but we had sent her over there. Oh, yeah, she probably would get excited off the... I just ripped the wax strips off of her. She don't need a trim. I give her that little bit of sensation with it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? So she can't fit. Yeah, I rip her coochie lips right off. Oh, no. <laughs> we going too hard. Drop a like on the stream. Can we get the 50 likes? Can we get the 50 likes? If your like button ain't blue, you a bitch. <laughs> Fortnite Master was popping. I ain't never played Fortnite still. One day I might play it. A gamer that don't play Fortnite, bro. How hipster can it get? Is that what he said? Are you talking about? What's that? You talking about that yourself? Yeah, I'm just saying that myself. Suicide Christ said his grandmother-in-law needs a trim on her kitty. First of all, how the fuck do you even know that? <laughs> That's the real fucked up thing in this situation. Grandmother-in-law? <laughs> Y'all dirty. We clean up your whole face, my G. We did, man. Finally. I know y'all thinking, finally, daddy's spending time with me. <laughs> that sound like a <laughs> That's a uh, Mav Hoffa. That's how he started his battles. He said, "I know y'all thinking finally, Daddy's spending time with me." <laughs> oh, man, I know that. He said it to the rappers every time. You running dope as we speak, Sonny? Damn, nigga, what you got for the? You know what I'm saying? For the phone to split. <laughs> Play with me, real street nigga shit. Yeah, I'm gonna make a video called I've Never Played Fortnite and I Don't Give a Fuck. This shit just look too cartoony for me, man. You know? Fortnite look a little too childish. Yeah. Too yeah. much cartoon shit be happening. I play PUBG, though. PUBG will have your ass have a heart attack every match. I heard about PUBG. It's, it feel like you really in the enemy's country, laying on the ground with just the guns. You don't got no map. You can't see where they at. Man, killed it, bro. I'm about to dive through the window. <laughs> what the fuck? Hmm. Oh, yeah. My girl finna put on some Victoria Don't Tell Nobody tonight. <laughs> hey, you, yo, clap. You funny as hell for that because, because I thought about that before. VR chat would be funny as hell if I did it. How do I do that? How do you do VR chat? The virtual reality video game is so stupid, bro. Because you see everybody as like a cartoon, but they be moving because it's on your heads and your shit. Oh, it's okay. so funny. <laughs> Let's play GTA when you get home. I ain't going home after this, nigga. I'm out here hustling. <laughs> Please say you are one of the boys. I don't know what the fuck you talking about, my nigga. But fuck it, I'm one of your boys. <laughs> I don't even know what VR GTA is, man. What is y'all talking about? Y'all know some shit I don't. One more top of the lip. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Point thinner. Mm -hmm. Normally, I be taking my time. It's 
since we live, we got to keep y'all in tune. So. And I was late. <laughs> And then rolling the whole makeover from the beginning to the end. That's how I make it. You got another one? 115. Yeah, I got one more for my little lunch break. I'm about to really think about getting me a YouTube going, man, just because I see how live y'all is and how y'all in tune. Definitely appreciate y'all sliding in here. You know what I mean? Thank y'all for supporting my boy right here. If y'all in the area, don't fuck with Bohem for sure. Oh yeah. You on your way to Madison from Milwaukee? Fuck with my nigga Bohem. For sure. Slide through. We get you on the books. You say you know my man's right here, we good. Look, we get, we get up in the nose too. Ain't, ah. ain't nothing in there, but <laughs> you know I mean? just in case, might be one or two little whiskers. That's love. Your barber ain't going in your nose for you fired at me. <laughs> <laughs> he ain't going in your nose for you fire him. I feel, I feel like I can hang out at a fancy restaurant now. Look, y'all. <laughs> <laughs> this was around for four hundred years. <laughs> Killed it. 60 likes, fuck yeah. Thank y'all so much, man. I'm gonna go live. Mm -hmm. Like really live, normally it's on the video game. I just said buzzing, I just, look, he said you need to make a YouTube channel. He just jumped in here. Yeah, I got you. Buzzington said, yo barber need to make a YouTube channel. This shit lit. Oh yeah, I definitely got you. 63 likes, damn, y'all jumped up that motherfucker. <laughs> See how much fun we be having, man? We be talking about current events, chicken sandwiches. The economy. Shaving your grandmama coochie on your daddy's side. <laughs> <laughs> My girl, mad lucky. You looking real nice. Hey, and, hey, and I'm blessed. <laughs> and I'm blessed. <laughs> Do I kiss my homies goodnight? I'll beat your motherfucking ass. No, but I kiss your mama goodnight. What's <laughs> today, Monday? He said, can you do anything with a bald ginger from Scotland? Oh, yeah. He said bald, what you mean? A bald ginger. He so said he got... Is, I know his head is red, right? Ginger? Yeah. What are you trying to get down? Do you need a beard or something? Hey, you come from Scotland, we got you, bro. I turned that into a whole YouTube series. Man, we had you right. You got the cash, fly me out on my way. Don't eat, uh, y'all some fucking crazy motherfuckers. Nothing, man, nothing, man. <laughs> you don't want to hear You don't want to hear that. <laughs> Y'all be respectful, my man. You know what I'm saying? We grown men in here. My man, a married man, father, grandfather, great grandfather. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he said grandfather. Yeah. <laughs> Take it right off. Take it all off. Give him the Michael Jordan. Show us my fit after the cut. What I'm wearing? A Masonic T-shirt. Y'all don't want to see that shit. Oh, some Jordan 4s, just some kickers. You know what I'm saying? Some motor lawn shoes. Got the Jordan 4s. Look, Aaron Runners. Feel me? Hey, the 4s is the most comfy, though. I ain't even gonna front. You like the 4s more, more than all of them? Yeah, what you like? I like the 12s. I like the 4s. Yeah, I'm a That's 12, what I wear. I'm a 12, 4, and 13. Yeah, yeah. What's my dream vehicle? It's, I don't know, man. There's some vehicles I really like. They're not really dream vehicles. They're feeling real attainable these days. But, I, you know, I've been looking at a Porsche Panamera. That thing looks so nice. Keep the lights coming, guys.
I'll show y'all what car I got. I'll go outside and show y'all. I don't give a shit. Good, Joey. You said to tell my barber to short out my caterpillars. What's that? What's your caterpillar with a mustache? <laughs> oh, your eyebrows. Oh, shit. That's what they My eyebrows about. look naturally beautiful. The caterpillar. I don't do my eyebrows, bro. That's the weirdest shit ever. I don't give a fuck what I look like. That's deep down inside. I'm a sociopath. So... I'll be getting that straight razor. 67 likes. Dang. I wasn't sure how many people would tune in. Y'all know this ain't gaming. All y'all know me for video game shit. So this is rare when you just see a real life video popping. It's all good. I think it was meant for you to do that so I can get join in. Yes, sir. Now they'll give me a game too. join the world. Yeah, that'd be nice. You know, no disrespect, but I don't play no games, baby. <laughs> I don't play no games. Whenever he see me coming to gym, he used to he used to put his outside shoes back on and pack it up. Hell yeah. Like, <laughs> this bum ass nigga walking here for the mess the gym up. <laughs> and my boy Joey got a shot though. Right in your face. They got a shot though. It's been a while since we played hoops, you know what I mean? Yeah, I ain't played basketball in a while, y'all. I don't think he ready for me. Brian, thank you so much. I appreciate you. Welcome to the stream, homie. That nigga said he was hiding in the corner at work watching our live stream. I know a lot of y'all got to work and do all that. <laughs> Thanks for y'all who spend the time to check in and say hi. I know a lot of y'all at work and stuff. You know, when I was at work, I used to put on Joe Rogan podcast on YouTube and have it behind my work. This is like art and real life. Everything mixed into one, man. <laughs> is YouTube my full-time job? Hell no, nigga, I'm broke. Let me get some donations. My barber is one of your friends on PSN talking about he don't play no games. You got a PlayStation? <laughs> I don't know if that's somebody. I, don't, I do got a PlayStation. I ain't been on there in a minute. You got a PlayStation 4? Yeah. They might know you. <laughs> <laughs> hey, he talking about he don't play no games. He got me thinking he don't play no games. He don't want y'all to pull up on him if he on GTA slipping. Ooh, wee. Hey, I look a little better than I used to, man. Shit. Said a little, huh? Look a little better. Matt, you a lanky bastard. <laughs> Yo, why y'all arguing anyway? <laughs> Gotta get that buzzer action right here. I know, should be on man. TV really enjoying me being real. Yeah, bro. Come on, tune in then. We're going to do more live streams like this. And when Bo make his channel, I'm going to be on there. Watching it live too, shit. Yeah, we don't know what, baby. But that's smooth as a baby's right there. Ain't it, man? That's smooth as a baby. District Gaming, thank you so much, man. I'm going to have to start learning more about y'all channels too, because I know it's cliche for YouTubers to let other people. I got a nice face cam set up, bro. I don't know why I don't use green screen and face cam more at home. Shit just, I'll just be feeling lazy. Yo, type exclamation point gamer tag with no spaces. Killed it. I'm gonna go to Target and leave with all the coochie in a in a shopping cart. Yeah. 
And there you have it. That's my gamer tags. Hey, thanks, Hank. I appreciate you. Y'all know how it is. Boom, gang, whole lot of gang shit. <laughs> 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 Oh, yeah, that's looking good right now, brother. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> hey, y'all see that goofy-ass nigga do that shit all the time? He got his ass beat. He said he changed his life. A good ass whooping will change your life. <laughs> Everybody go <laughs> laughing the ass. <laughs> nah, I never do that to Bohem, man. What's that, runoff? Yeah, runoff. Right this shit's so stupid on social media. That shit look dumb. <laughs> I'm sure he didn't either. I'm sure that was just all set up. Scripted. Yeah. I'm sure he paid for it and then ran off. He be getting his ass for the next time he showed up. Oh, yeah. If you in the hood and you do that, you ain't going to make it too far, bro. Everybody going to know you did it the first day. And somebody gonna beat your motherfucking ass. People will just start testing you. If they know you hitting licks, they're gonna start hitting licks on your ass too. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? That's the thing, man. Once people start testing you in the black community, you done. The hood is a myth. <laughs> yeah, right, nigga. I'm gonna have a hole in my pancreas. Why? <laughs> That's some weird shit, bruh. I don't want to have no holes in my pancreas. You from the north side of Milwaukee? Tempest? I know you was from Milwaukee talking that crazy shit. <laughs> Only people from Milwaukee say Milwaukee better than Madison. <laughs> not, listen, Milwaukee is not the worst place in the world, but it's top five. Feel me? That make a lot of sense. The segregation, man... And yeah, just it's a the, lot of segregation in yeah. Milwaukee, man. I'm glad, you know, the basketball team doing well, bring some more attraction. Right. The rave is one, because we don't really get too many artists here. The rave stay packed. Yep. But we got the Sylvie, though. So they need to come with it. It's the capital of Wisconsin, baby. <laughs> John, don't say Appleton better. Are you an Appleton, John? Oh, Welcome to Appleton. the stream. Appleton popping, bro. Yeah, I know some. Indeed. I be up there. Don't get me wrong. Fox Valley, nigga. They got, I don't know about the Fox Valley, nigga. Yeah. Ooh, he got me right. <laughs> wow. John Doe is a hick name. I just mean you don't want to give up your real name. That's all John Doe means. What y'all think, man? Ooh, he got me right. He even faded my, my my folds into each other, y'all. <laughs> you can't even see the folds. Looking fresh? All right, I'll pay him then. If y'all think I should pay him, type one in the chat. If you think I should beat him up and run away, <laughs> type two. <laughs> this is my dude, man. Bo, he. <laughs> we in the mirror, baby. We is. Yay. $69? Hey, y'all, I need y'all to throw down on my haircut, man. Let me get $30 in donations. Everybody give me a dollar right now so then I can pay you. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much, brother. Yeah, Sam, you spray down real quick. Oh, shit, he about to take my soul. <laughs> Finish him. Dun, dun, dun. Two, beat him up. Ah! <laughs> Because I know somewhere deep down in my heart, I still love you. <laughs> Shut your broke ass up. Real groom sessions over here, baby. <laughs> man, this was a fun experience, y'all. Yes, indeed. I, my man got to get the barbershop show popping. 73 likes. Thank y'all so much, man. Oh, good, my brother. 
get some food while I'm around here somewhere. You want me to catch up with you again? Yeah, yeah, that works. Remember last time they made us both verify our account and all that shit? Was Every, crazy. Everybody. Oh, you seen that? Yeah, everybody got to do it. They, they trying to make sure no fraud going on. Yeah, this is, this opened up the door for a lot of fraud. But that's why people weren't using it. They were saying Cash App wasn't, you know what I'm saying, legit. So people were sending PayPal, Venmo. Mm -hmm. uh, what's that, Zelly? Yeah, Zelle is the future. Yeah. That's what I use. Yeah, you I use guess, Zelle too? Yeah, I got Zelle as well. That might be, you know what I'm saying? If they don't let me send this on Cash App, I ain't playing no games with them. I delete this shit. Oh, yeah, that's oh, it worked. We did. Then we do Zelle last yeah, time. Yeah, it worked though. This oh, time. Sounds good. We all good, brother. Nice. It fucking worked, y'all. Last time it made me look broke in front of one of his other customers. <laughs> I went to send the money and they was like, nah, hold up, nigga. <laughs> Man. So how, you, how do you get your YouTube followers up? I just play, I just, you know, it's just whatever audience you're a part of. Right. You just start tagging it and putting the titles and they'll find you. You know what I'm saying? Whatever you like to talk about. If I was you, I would just talk about current events and then do it in the shop. In the shop right. Then it'll always be popping. Right. Get the going. Right. See? That's the perfect position camera, too. That's why you put that up there? It's been on your mind, then. One of my clients just said, bro, I'm sorry. Somebody got killed in my house last night. He missed his, what? He missed his cut. <laughs> See, you can't make that shit up, bro. In Madison? Yeah. That's only the he second. Was me. He was, that's he, only second homicide this year. His cut it? was before yours. He just called me and said, bro, I'm sorry. I couldn't make my cut. Somebody got killed. Holy moly. Oh, I'm sorry. Somebody, someone got killed in my house last night. Let me tell y'all something about Madison. <laughs> we had two homicides this year, 2019. One was like three days ago, and I guess the second one was just this morning <laughs> at this nigga house over here. We don't have much killings. Wow. That's tripped out. Any That's last words? Out. Hey, man, I appreciate y'all for tuning in. Be looking now. I'm about to have a YouTube, too. Thanks to my boy, but I do appreciate how it's going down. And uh, we signing out, man. Yes, sir. Hey, thank you, bro. <laughs> See you later, brother. Yes, indeed. Thank you, man. I'm good. Your water. Oh, yeah. Damn. Yeah. Stay hydrated. And to get my water, I got like 30 of these for $5. <laughs> Peace out, bro. Yes, sir. I ain't going nowhere. Where y'all going? We live, nigga. Look, this is the, got a zit on my face, got that to my girl, my girl gonna have to pop that for me. Wave check, just kidding, I don't do that. I know as soon as my girl see this zit, she gonna run up and try to pop it. That's my girl. Wave check. There we go. That's the final. Look, look. Should I get a tattoo right here? Look. God damn it, it's raining outside. It's raining. Just so y'all know, it's raining. Y'all wanna know? Here go my car right here. This my car. You know, this look a little bit all right. This how we rolling. We went from barber shop to the whip. Ooh, ooh, ooh. We in the whip now. Y'all get what y'all asked for. Feel me? Yeah, I'm in Wisconsin, man. I'm in Madison, bruh. 
I'm in the car. Got the gun holster on the seat. You don't want to know, bruh. You don't want to know the status. There we go. Car still a piece of shit. For those asking. That's the status. <laughs> Shitty as a motherfucker. This fucking thing took forever. All right, we on the road now, y'all. Thanks for tuning in to my barbershop live stream. You dig? That shit was fun, wasn't it? I did put my seatbelt on. We in here. Normally, I be listening to some motherfucking... We listen to the trap music. He said, it's not raining in Milwaukee. You in Milwaukee, bruh? You got bigger problems than the weather. Y'all know where we at. We in Wisconsin. In the capital. You got bigger problems than the weather, bruh. So what's up, y'all? I'm about to... I might conclude the screen this this damn this nigga in the in the rain he looked like he'd been walking around soaked for a minute i'm gonna conclude the stream put my song on yeah i got records bruh i got plenty of songs i would love to turn up but they on fucking copyright strike my shit, man. We driving by the Children's Museum right now. This is what I this is what I see right now, y'all. Feel me? It's my view. Feel me? We mobbing down the street right now. Okay, now. We, we'll pull right up to Popeye's and do a chicken review right now, too. Let's get it. <laughs> Yo, ain't this technology great, y'all? Y'all went to a haircut with me. Y'all see me leaving, going to the crib. I got some work to do. What state I'm in, man, I'm in a state of awareness. Now I'm in Wisconsin. Yeah, thanks, man. I appreciate it.
We, if we gonna get I copyright strike, we gonna listen to my shit. 100%, 110%. Ain't no cut on this shit. y'all. This shit blue magic, nigga. Like Frank Lucas, nigga, I'm gone. Old trap spot at the bottom of the hill. Straight up. Tryna diss savage. Take care. I'll be live later. Get my shooter smoke.